Hey everyone, welcome back to more Zola Classic, uh, the third quest here. So this, yeah, the whole first part was basically getting Blue Ring, and that's always good to pick up because it doubles our defense. And this part here, again, I'm just going to be staying outside. I'm not even going to go into the first level for a while, actually. Uh, because there's a... Uh, so this part here, I'm going to start showing a few of the secrets here. So, you know, this used to be a potion shop, and now instead it's a minus 20. Uh, which is why I'm doing it now, because I only had one rupee. So, you can take my one rupee, I could care less. Uh, this one is... I think it's still here. Yeah, same spot. So what you're familiar with before, it's maybe not so much the case now, so... So I'm gonna be getting a lot of these minus 20s, yeah, I'm gonna be wasting some money here, so... Uh, I'm trying to remember what was on this screen here... Because again, in the fourth quest, everything changes, and all the stuff is different again. So that used to be a plus 30, and now it's a, you know, one of those pay me for repair the door things. So I'm getting as many of these out of the way as I can, so I don't have to worry about it. Yeah, it used to be a place you can buy your big shield here. Uh, that's not the case now. So now that's a minus 20 thing here. So I'm just going off and getting all those out of the way um, at this point, just to, again, just to save trouble later on. Uh, this used to be a potion shop, and I, I think it's one of those like you have to pay money for info. Uh, I forgot which one it was. It was a ten thirty fifty or something. This one, uh, where do they put the secret on this one? I know it's another, um, you know, I don't think it used to have anything in it, actually. But a lot of, like, minus 20s here, so, uh, again, I'm just getting these out of the way. So if you want to use this as kind of a reference, it's like, oh, there's another minus 20 here. Uh, I think this one's a potion shop. Yeah, <clears throat> a potion shop right there. Uh, this one used to be I think, actually a minus 20, but now it turns into this kind of money-making game thing, which I don't even have any money for. Fresh out of money. To the left is another one of those pay me and I'll talk secrets. Well, not secrets, it's actually been there since the first quest. So, same thing. I think it even gives the same hint. So, it's not even any different. And there's still quite a number of minus 20s I'm gonna show you here. Actually, that money-making game, let me just take a, a shot at it here. Let me go get a few more rupees and just take a shot at it. See if I get lucky. If I get lucky, I might be able to put that down towards a magic shield here. Uh, but if I get, like, the minus 40 or minus 10, it doesn't really make a difference because I have no money left. Bombs back right there. Refills are always nice to get. 
I really could use a better sword here. Uh, unfortunately, I'm gonna get that for a little while. It's kind of in a random spot where they put the... Uh, the white sword. You know, it's not in the place you're used to, obviously. I actually don't know, the first two quests are in the same spot, so... No difference there, but here the third quest is in a pretty much completely different spot. Uh, you might as well try, you know. There's another minus 20 nearby here anyway, so... Uh. Okay, I got 20 rupees. Uh, I don't know. It's still a lot of work to get the magic shield. Okay, you know what? Maybe I... Okay, I'll try to grind for that magic shield now. Uh, there's a minus 20 to the left there. I'll get that later. <clears throat> got some... Got some money here. So... Half expecting to get like minus 10 or minus 40 so that I could just get the minus 20 out of the way. Well, I might as well get the magic shield because that's gonna be handy for later. Uh, let me see if there are any more secrets around here. I'm looking at my map right now. The problem is, again, it's just an Excel file, so I, I kind of have to... ...look at it to see where I am on the map. I think this screen always had something in it. Uh, always had a plus 10, and actually still has a plus 10 here. So, I think it's just in a different spot. Trying to work up to that 90 rupees here. And again, I won't be entering level 1 for a while. It's actually nearby here. I'll be, you know, it doesn't hurt to get equipment beforehand. Now, I think it, the third and fourth quests are actually pretty linear. I don't know how much you can actually skip around. It's not like the, uh, you know, first quest, I always take out level three first. Because level one, level two don't give you anything. Well, it's not useful right off the bat. I mean, it takes a while for it to become useful. Uh, I think this one still has plus ten. So they actually kept this one the same here. Plus ten here. I'm like literally trying to find every secret I can find here. Every bit of cash I can get. Uh, there is something here, but I'm not gonna do that at this time. Uh, this screen I think has a potion. A uh, potion shop right here. I'm trying to remember where it was. Again, you don't get the letter for a while. I don't, I don't remember when you get the bow in this... ...this quest, actually. Uh, so I don't know when I need the arrow. I hope I don't need it soon, because I have to grind up another 80 rupees just to get the, the arrows. Uh, 
Uh, this screen here... I think it's a gambling spot. making game right here, so I'm not gonna do it now because I actually have some cash. I'm pretty close to that 90 mark here. No, I do it when I only have like 10 rupees and I don't even care if I get, you know, minus 10 or minus 40. You know, if I'm trying to find all these minus 20s anyway. Uh, I don't think there's anything on this screen. I mean, I burned every bush, I used a flute. Uh, maybe I'm missing something there, but... I'll look for it later. Well, I got enough money now. Uh... So I, let me go get that magic shield really quick. Look at this. It's like you, you think it'd be at that lone bush, but no, they put it in the low, lower corner here. There's a lot of minus 20s in this area. I uh, want to see if I can scoop those up. You know, at least get those out of the way so I have to, don't have to remember them. I'm trying to remember if there's a minus 20 nearby here. I think there is. I think there are two of them. Oh, never mind. Okay, I might as well just go by the arrow then. Yeah, of course, it's like when I try to actually get the minuses, I keep getting the pluses here. Yeah, I'm actually pretty close to getting the arrow, actually. I might as well buy that while I'm at it. I only need another nine rupees here. I mean, I wouldn't use that as a source for money here. Uh, because it's just not reliable, unless... You know, if you're playing on, like, the original NES, you just use save states and, you know, manipulate which one, because it's set in place once you go inside the whatever location. So you can pretty much... Um... You know, you go in there, if you get like a minus 40, then you know that one has the minus 40, so you know which one has the plus. So you basically then take the plus one. It's kind of a cheap way to... to do it, but, you know, beats grinding for cash here. So I might as well pick up this one, at it. Why waste good money? I know there's one other thing I can buy here. I'm really trying to get to those minus 10, so that I, or minus uh, 20, so that I can at least get those out of the way, but every time I do this, I keep getting plus money here. You know, you're right next to the gambling spot, you might as well try your luck here. See, look, every time I get, like, pluses, and I, I think I've chosen the center every single time. It's not like I'm trying to be strategic here, I just literally just pick the center every time. And I keep getting pluses. It's, like I'm, it's like, not like I'm trying to get the pluses here, I just happen to be getting them. Oh, 
Okay, so I know there's something else I can buy here. So, I'm gonna go get that really quick. So, we might as well, we might as well go scoop that up. Well, now all the money is starting to drop here. Look at this. Had a little difficulty with money at the beginning, and now it's like just rupees dropping everywhere here. Actually, I think there's another secret here. Now, this used to be a, I guess, a hint, or so I forgot what the hint was about, but uh, now they replaced it with a secret here. Uh, 10 rupees right there. Alright, so I might as well go buy some meat while I'm at it. Because uh, you're going to need this for later on. Okay, now I don't think there's any more stuff I can buy right now, because I can't get a potion, because you don't get the letter for a good while. I'm going to show you what's up here. Uh, it's not the white sword. FYI here. I forgot what that hint was for. I know one of the hints tells you where the power bracelet is. Uh, I forgot what that one was about. It's kind of annoying, you gotta go all the way around here. Uh, this one here, I believe, is a another big shield shop here. Yeah, I'm not gonna go back all the way to the lower left corner just to get a minus 20 here. I'll do that later, because I have to go that way anyway. <clears throat> uh, now, I know there is a... bombable thing here somewhere. Um... I know it's to get this out of the way. So, that used to be a... I think it's only second quest, though. Uh, second quest, that was a... a potion shot. And you had to use the flute. Uh, this screen, I know, has something in it. Now, if I can find it, that is. I know you're around here somewhere. Another big shield shop right here. FYI. I'm gonna go find some bombs. I'm actually almost out of bombs right now. Uh, so, you know, this used to be something good, right? Well, at least in the first quest. Uh, now it's another... those minus 20 things. Of course, I'm completely broke right now. Which I kept trying to do it. You know, I get these out of the way, but I kept getting, you know, the gambling thing, I kept getting plus money. Well, I can't put that money to waste. Yeah, so I'm just getting these out of the way while I'm at it. Um, I know there's one down here, actually. Let me go get this one out of the way. There's a few other scattered ones. It's like, you think you found something good here, but then look at it, you find all these stupid minus 20s here. You know, when I was exploring all this, I was like, oh my gosh, I found something good, and it's like, you know, pay me for door repair. I was like, oh my gosh. The minus 20 here. That's when I actually had money at that point, so... You 
Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that alone for a reason. Uh, another money-making game right here. Look, I'm just going out of my way to get all these out of the way here. this out of the way. <clears throat> and I know there's still a few more I can find here. Again, there's the one in the lower left corner. I mean, I don't really care right now because there's really nothing really nothing to buy right now, actually. I really want to try to get as many minus 20s out of the way as I can before I start, you know, finding the other secrets. I think I got most of them on the right side. Oh no, there's actually more here. Oh, I forgot this one. Because I kept trying to get it, you know, get this out of the way, but I kept finding the, you know, the money-making game, I kept getting plus money. So it kind of kept delaying me a little bit there. Uh, this one is... Yeah, see, not, not where you would expect. But see, there are a lot of these minus 20s here. At least you don't go into debt here. You know, if you're at zero, you stay at zero, you know, and you don't go, like, minus rupees, because then that's gonna be a real problem. So, you know, you don't go any lower than zero here. So at least that's some convenience for you. No difference here, I think it's the same shop as always here. I think this is just a regular candle shop. This one, I think, used to have a potion shop. So that's another, yeah, minus 20. <laughs> I'm broke already, yeah, you don't have to, there's no money to take from me anymore. I think this one changes. Uh, this used to be anything from regular shop uh, to I think letter. You get the letter there in the first quest. Uh, now it's just a potion shop. Uh, this used to be a minus twenty. So now they change it around a little bit here. Here's one of the few things that's been preserved <laughs> in all three quests so far. It's the same money-making game thing here. Uh, I'm just looking at my Excel sheet to see if I covered as much as I could. Now, some of these I can't reach right now because they're like on the other side here.
I think I got most of them here. Yeah, so it's just that one in the lower left. Okay. Um, again, I'm just going to be getting more minus 20s in the next part anyway, so I'm actually going to go get some more stuff. I think I got most everything here. Oh, see, I lost my 10 rupees right there. That's not really going to matter too much to me because still some minus 20s for me to find here. Yeah, this used to be something else, and now you just get a regular hint here. So, this thing, it's kind of a weird hint. So, basically, if there was something significant in, uh, I guess, the first two quests, uh, they put stuff there, as you'll see. Now, I haven't shown you everything so far. You know, that heart container I got was a 100 rupee thing in the second quest. But this is kind of a general hint here. In that, again, as a, you know, whatever was important before, you know, they kind of swap stuff around. So, okay, so that found a lot of minus 20s. Uh, I actually bought some good stuff here. Okay, so we'll take a break here, and uh, next part, uh, I'm going to actually go left, uh, do some scouting there. Uh, now that you have magic shield, we can actually a little more safe, feel a little more safer going on the left side now. Alright, uh, I'll see you guys later.